What's up everybody? It's your girl Priscilla Lady A. Warren and as always thank you so much for watching the videos. Thank you for commenting on the videos and thank you so much for sharing the videos. I really do appreciate it. I wanted to uh, hop on this morning and just encourage somebody along their way. Many of you know that I am on a journey to transform my entire life. That's right. I am transforming my entire life life every area of my life from finances to relationships to my body um to everything everything that that is life in my life that does not um look like the promise of god i am transforming those areas in my life and so uh, I think it, back in December, December of 2013, I had this encounter, if you will, um, with God. And it was it was so powerful, so amazing, that it literally um, just propelled me into a whole nother place, a whole different, you know, just, just a different thought process. Um, I, I would want to call it an awakening, if you will. Um, and over these last, I want to say, six months of learning and changing and transforming, yeah, I will admit, it has not been an easy process. It has not been um, a, a walk. <laughs> it ain't been no walk in the park. Okay, understand that. Um, most days, some days are great. Some days, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm up. I'm, I'm high. I'm, I'm positive. I'm, you know. I'm just looking forward to to whatever God is going to do next. And then there are other days where I'm like, look, don't nobody talk to me, please. I, you know, I'm, I'm, you know, I can't see the forest for the trees. You know, everything is running through my brain. That you know, all of the thoughts that that negative thoughts that that need to go away are bombarding my mind. And I've come to the place to understand that. After 41 years of living and thinking in a certain way and living a certain way, it takes time to one, identify the, the, the areas or the thoughts that do not serve you. It takes time because it's, it's normal, it's natural to you. It feels natural you know, to you because you've lived this way for so long. I had lived you know, I, so the, the way that I was living for so long. So how do I learn to live a different way? You know, I had lived from paycheck to paycheck for so long. So how do I learn how to live a different way? How do I create several streams of income? How do I learn how to, you know, grow financially? How I had lived for so long as far as my eating habits were concerned with fried foods and fast food and and soda and all of the other junk that does not serve me so now I'm in the process of understanding how to eat what to eat what not to eat what is going to produce the harvest that I want to see in my life in my body you know everything come you know the, the video that I did the other day talked about everything comes from a seed and everything is seed <laughs> and you're seeing the fruit of whatever the seed is that you're planting and so i'm i'm clear in my understanding that if i want to see a different harvest in my life then that means i have to think differently about whatever it is that i want to see that whatever i want to change i have to think differently about that thing and plant seeds new seeds in that area so i can get a different harvest so I said all that to say, last night I went to Zumba class and over my, my period of time of transformation, um, you know, I go to, go to the gym, I work out and, um, and, but for the past couple of weeks, I've been, I've been off my game. You know, my mind was, was somewhere else and you know, it, it just, I, it was just not in a good place. But last night I went to Zumba class and as I was in Zumba, and I was, oh my God, I felt like she was just kicking my butt, seriously. Uh, as I was in Zumba, I could hear the Lord saying, Priscilla, these are seeds. Every class you go to 
every time you lift your leg, every time you raise your arm, every time you wipe sweat from your brow, these are seeds that you are planting. I can't expect to have um, the, the weight that I want to lose. I can't expect the weight to be gone in 24 hours. It don't work that way. Seed don't work that way. In the in natural, in the natural, when you plant a seed, it don't it doesn't work that way. <laughs> it takes time for it to what? It there is a process. It takes time for the seed to grow. And so I just want to encourage somebody tonight that as you work your business, as you learn how to build your several streams of income, as you learn how to eat, how to maintain your temple. How, how to exercise, as you learn how to relate differently to people, as you begin to think differently about these areas of your life, please do not get discouraged when things don't change as quickly as you would like for them to, because it's going to take time. For me, I've had 41 years of sowing bad seed in my life, and now I'm at a point where I've recognized the bad seed, I've dug up the, the bad seed and I'm planting new seed, new thoughts, new actions in those areas. And so now it's only been six months of my journey of transformation, but I want it to happen quickly. You know, I want to be, you know, where I need to be, you know, now <laughs> rather than, you know, a year, two years, three years down the road. So I just want to encourage somebody take the time just keep doing what you're doing keep doing what you're doing and eventually eventually that goal that you've set you'll reach that goal eventually that those several streams of income that you're trying to build you will build each and every single one how can a man lay a brick in a pattern every single day if you lay one brick each day how can you not eventually have a wall? How can you not eventually have a building? If you keep laying the bricks, eventually you will have your building. So with that, I pray that I've said something that has helped you, inspired you, encouraged you, uplifted you, motivated you on today. Until next time, peace and blessings.